The old International Space Station has grown to such an extent in the 28th century as a result of collaboration between Earth and extraterrestrial species that the Earth's gravitational field could be disrupted by its mass. It is moved to deep space and becomes Alpha, a space city with millions of species from thousands of planets living there. Valerian and his partner Lorline work for the United Human Federation's Police Division, which was established to maintain peace throughout the galaxy. Valerian had visions on the way to a mission about a planet called Mull, where a primitive humanoid race uses animals to clone itself in order to fish for pearls that store energy. An enormous spacecraft that crashed into the planet destroyed Mull, resulting in an extinction event. Lehomina, the planet's princess, is left behind outside the abandoned ship as a few of the occupants enter and unintentionally imprison themselves inside. She sends out an energy wave carrying a psychic message shortly before she passes away. The goal of Valerian and Loreline's mission is to get the final Mull Converter out of the hands of Igan Cyrus, a black market dealer. Valerian interrupts a meeting between Igan and two hooded beings that resemble the humanoids from his dream in a marketplace on the planet Kyrian in an alternate universe. They are looking for the little animal in his dream, the Converter. After Loreline and Valerian retrieve the Converter, they pilfer an energy pearl. Valerian discovers on board their spacecraft that Mole was destroyed 30 years prior, and that all knowledge regarding it is secret. When they get back to Alpha, Commander Arun Fillet tells them that an unidentified force has irradiated the station center, making it extremely toxic. The radiation is rising, and the troops that were dispatched into the region have not returned. During an interstation summit to discuss the crisis, Loreline and Valerian are tasked with protecting the commander. Despite the commander's intentions, Loreline keeps the converter in her custody. Unidentified humanoids unexpectedly attack the summit, rendering everyone helpless and capturing Fillet. Valerian's spacecraft crashes while pursuing the kidnappers to the radioactive area. Valerian can be found at the edge of the radioactive zone thanks to Loreline's tracking of him with the help of alien information brokers known as Dogen Daguis. The Bulan bathers of the planet Gora kidnaps her, and serves her as the choice course at their emperor's feast. Valerian uses the shape-shifting bubble to his advantage to sneak into the tribe's territory. After saving Loreline, they flee, but Bubble suffers a deadly wound. Valerian and Loreline explore further of the radioactively contaminated area and find that it is safe to enter and that it has the remnants of an old spacecraft. When they arrive at a big, shielded hall, they discover the pearls, a group of humanoids, along with an unconscious fillet. Emperor Haben Limai, the head of the pearls, states that until a conflict broke out between the Federation and an adversarial extraterrestrial species, his people lived in peace on Mull. The enemy mothership was rendered inoperable by Fillet, the human commander, who also gave the order to use fusion missiles, which caused Mull to crash into the planet and be destroyed. Princess Lehomina infused Valerian's body with her spirit after she passed away. The remaining pearls were stranded in a downed spacecraft during the war, but they overcame it and gained knowledge of human history and technology. Scrap ships transported their ship to Alpha, where they constructed their own ship and learned more from other species. To launch their ship and locate a planet to replicate their homeworld, they required the converter and pearl. Although Philid acknowledges his part in the genocide, he maintains that the war had to end and the genocide had to be covered up to keep humanity standing in power in Alpha. In contrast, Valerian and Loreline feel that the commander is attempting to evade the repercussions of his conduct. Philid gets aggressive, and Valerian knocks him out. After giving Igan the pearl he had taken, Valerian is convinced to return the converter by Loreline. Philet's Catron robot troops assault the Pearls as they prepare their spacecraft for departure, and although the government soldiers are dispatched to aid Valerian, they are finally beaten. As the spaceship takes off, Philet is taken into custody. As they wait for rescue, Loreline responds to Valerian's marriage proposal with a maybe, 
after they are abandoned on an Apollo Command Service Module.